Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. This is the last and third part of the twin HMI Mudbus project. So before I am going to start, I want to show you some uh, detail of uh, microcontroller and HMI which I uh, already connected. So this is the four channel enabled of uh, 8266 uh, which you have uh, Wi-Fi also. So you can see there is four relay, one, two, three, four. And uh, please see this four is the LED. When the relay is on, this LED will be on. When the LED will off, relay will be off, okay? And uh, it has a 220 volt uh, supply uh, here, you can see. This board I am uh, uh, buying from local market, uh, available online also and uh, this is the uh, converter of modbus converter uh, which is converting the uh, ttl serial to modbus uh, you can see here clearly right a b and ground and uh, this is the tx rx okay and uh, you see the connection here and uh, this is the simple the connection goes to the HMI the HMI here you can see this HMI I have and uh, here you can see the model number okay and uh, the connector here BA with for RS485 VG4 power supply okay so I'm going to put it here okay so our demonstration is ready so i'm going to power on both you can see yeah when the controller is ready it will be on yes this is on now you can see it's on okay okay now the power supply is on of this controller so i'm going to on and off each relay so you can see relay 1 relay 2 relay 3 relay 4 uh, this graphic design already i explained in my last video part 2 and the same screen i'm using here uh, don't need to any confusion and uh, sure I will give the link for download this project and uh, I tell you one thing this uh, it has the program of Modbus which I designed by use my Basino software so you can see the LED light is off or relay is off so now I press here you see on you see LED is on if I press off, you see LED is gone again. On, off, on, off, on, off, on, off. Okay, now I put. Uh, <coughs> all relay should be on one two three four you can hear the noise of relay latching you see all relay are on and you see here you see very clearly all four relays on if i put here press the off button off you see first relay is off other three are on you see the first relay is off other three are on so i off all relay now off 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 you see all relay are off check here there's no release on. okay this is the digital part and the for analog for example here i have uh, i have to set some parameter actually i am preparing the logic like this i can set the value here the value will goes to the controller a controller is sent back that value to presenting here presently this is the wrong value so if i press save data you see 
all value is here you can see if i put here uh, one two double five something like this enter and when i press save data you see one two double five has come here okay here also same thing if i put some value here 8551 and press enter uh, save you can 851 so it means i can send this value to this controller the controller reading the value and sending back to the hmi because in my case hmi is master this is the master okay and uh, here you can see the date time and this save data is most important it's must required to send this data after feed whatever you want okay this is the simple simple demonstration and you can check my board uh, in this video I will upload, uh, give the link uh, in the downside you can download this demo project and uh, you can see this two light blinking okay mud bus because its communication is on now so that's it so now I am going to present a something new thing just wait yes okay now we have to shift here this and uh, can see my controller here and my HMI here I start on my PC <clears throat> so guys uh, I hope you can see my screen okay This is the very interesting part of this video, which you make. Okay, guys, this is my SCADA screen. I hope you can see. Okay, so this is doing display with SCADA system, and uh, you see the system ready light is on. System ready light is on. Okay, now. If I press here on, you see it's on, relay also on, you see here relay one is on, okay, off, on, now start relay two, on, off, on, this is relay three, relay four, on, you know, now see relay 1 on, relay 2 on, relay 3 on, relay 4 on, all relays on, okay, and you see here value, 851, 1, same value here also, 851, 1, so relay is completely on, you can see, so I can control this board by using between HMI Modbus programming and same time with SCADA system also together you can see my screen okay I hope uh, you can see the full full frame of the SCADA okay now you see all relay are on all relay are on okay so I make it off from here HMI off 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 now see all relay are off okay for example i set here some data five two five eight four 
enter save data you can see the data here 584 here if I put some data 7025 enter save data 7025 okay okay this is the part of control of the HMI you can see this is the HMI which I control here it's very close to my monitor now I can use my mouse to use a scanner okay you see relay one is on you can see here relay one is on okay now relay two is on now you can see relay two is on okay now relay three is on c third relay also on relay four is on you see you see relay four is on so all four relay are on so you can see here so i make it off one by one one two three four you see all relay goes off here also all relay goes off at the same time i can press here one on you see on two three four okay off 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 you see okay now i can set the value from here also for example i want to set uh, one two four seven here enter you see one two four seven and same time you see the value here found one two four seven okay for example i set here five two zero three enter five two zero three you see five two zero three same thing here also Three two eight nine. Enter. Sorry, three six eight nine. You see, three six eight nine. Three two five eight. Three two five eight. Enter. Three two five eight. You see here. Is it three two five eight? Okay. So, just I want to explain to you at the same time, this is the master also and this CADA also master, Mudbus master, but and the controller is one, at the same time, I can control a slave unit, a slave unit, it has two ID, part one, uh, Mudbus ID one, Mudbus ID two, slave ID one, slave ID two, it has programmed like this. So I can control together this HMI, Dwin HMI connected by serial Mudbus as you can see here and this SCADA is connected by Mudbus TCP over Wi-Fi. At the same time you can control the this module from two places. Okay. So this is the advantage of the Dwin display. So guys, and uh, microcontroller program by Vasino. As you know, the Vasino is the leading programmer software for Arduino. It can support many type of controllers from starting to Arduino to many, many things. You can see the website. And, uh, and this is the quality of the Dwayne display. I will show you again. You see guys, I already presented that uh, sketch program for the Dwin display in my part 2 and this part also I upload the final sketch this is the simple connection okay, okay. thank you for watching man. thank you please keep join my youtube channel must like it
and uh, in future i will upload many many videos which you can like thank you